Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are excitedly awaiting the arrival of their first baby, but in a shock twist, could it be that the little royal already arrived? Last year, Meghan Markle, Duchess of Sussex, said her baby was due towards the end of April. Now, after much speculation about whether we'd see Meghan and Prince Harry on the steps of the Lindo Wing, it seems the couple have finally cleared things up. On Thursday Buckingham Palace released a statement about the couple's intentions, but the ambiguous note has left everyone wondering if the Sussex baby is already here. The statement said, The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are very grateful for the goodwill they have received from people throughout the United Kingdom and around the world as they prepare to welcome their baby. Their Royal Highnesses have taken a personal decision to keep their plans around the arrival of their baby private. The Duke and Duchess look forward to sharing the exciting news with everyone once they have had an opportunity to celebrate privately as a new family. Some believe the last sentence proves the baby has already arrived, and we'll find out when they are ready to share the news with the world. Meghan was last seen in public on March 19, when she visited New Zealand House with Prince Harry to pay their respects for those killed in the Christchurch terror attack. According to reports, Meghan started her maternity leave on March 20. Since this announcement from Buckingham Palace comes nearly a month after Meghan's final engagement, royal fans are assuming that means the baby is coming soon, if not, already. There have been a few other clues. Makeup artist Daniel Martin, rumored to be the baby's godfather, headed to London earlier this month to be with Meghan, his former client and close friend. The couple also created their very own Instagram profile, which experts assume is where they'll share the first pictures of their new bundle of joy. And since it's been widely reported that Meghan won't give birth in the Lindo wing like her sister-in-law, Kate Middleton, it's plausible the child's birth could have been kept under wraps. However, if we use Kate's pregnancies as a guide, royals typically give birth one month after going on maternity leave. In the case of Prince Louis, Kate went on maternity leave on March 22 and gave birth on April 23. So, that means it's possible Meghan won't be giving birth until around April 20, which aligns with the initial prediction that the royal baby is due in late April. Either way, it seems we'll have to wait until the couple decide they're ready to share their happy news with the world. Meghan and Harry have taken steps to increase their privacy in recent months after an initial flurry of media attention caused Harry to worry about Meghan's safety when they started dating. The couple have moved out of Kensington Palace where Kate and Prince William live, and into their own home in Windsor. Nestled in the lead grounds of Frogmore Estate, Meghan and Harry will raise their young family in peace and privacy.